hello and welcome to today's video and this video is about the incandescent version of the shower bathroom mirror light and first we'll show you the shaver socket and this can run at 110 or 230 volt and to up to switch you basically switch this switch here and it's currently switched to 230 volt the pull cord is for the light because this light is wired different to mine this one is wired to the mains with the shaver socket on all the time and the switch to operate the light and mine has a double wire going to it so it has main voltage permanent live and switched live to the light switch which is the reason why mine didn't have a pull cord some information on it diffuser must be fitted for light to operate and the model number st a4 60 watt max ip20 230 volt 50 hertz isolate mains before servicing and some other information as well this is the end cap now basically one of these end caps is fixed and the other one pushes in to fit the bulb in so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to put my camera on a tripod and we'll show you the bulb and then i'll put the light together now this is the incandescent lamp basically it has two bayonet lights one on the other side it is slightly darkened there is the filament and it has like two small bayonets on either end but without the little balls to hold them in the cap because basically the light holds it in so we'll fit the lamp push in this side and release and make sure the filament is pointing downwards now I'm going to fit the shade and as you see as soon as I fitted the shade the light came on it is flickering a little bit but it's only flickering on the camera if I turn the light off you might see the filament cool down yep and turn it back on I'm not going to turn this on and off like a fluorescent light because you can damage incandescent tip lights very easily anyway I hope you enjoyed this follow-up video of this incandescent 60 watt bathroom light the other light in the bathroom is one of the 2d versions and that is an IP rated light as well and I think we'll just show that as well so I'll just pause and move the camera there we go there is the bathroom light that has been changed to a Philips 2D and if I get the camera set up in the correct place we'll be able to show this light on startup as well so I'll just pause it one more time here we go so 2D on 2D off, 2D on. Two D off. Two D on. And this is an electronically ballasted version. You know, I like to say 
Thank you very much and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please like and subscribe. Goodbye.